We'll be able to look at the deflection of the wires now that we know the directions of the fields are opposing. Uh, if you look, you'll see that we have our same loop that we had before, a multiple loop system. Uh, the one side where the current is going up, this is on this wire, it's lined up with number one. So we'll call this the number one. And it's lined up with pretty close to four centimeters on the scale. The other side where the current's coming down, it's lined up number two, we'll call that one, and it's lined up with just short of 5.5, about 5.3 or 5.4, depends on where you are and where I am. We just wanna see if it deflects. So I'm gonna to touch the wire so current will flow and watch what happens. The one that was at four is now at about 3.4. So it's moved about 0.6. The one that was a 5.5 is now up to 6.3. So they've gone from roughly a centimeter and a half apart to now just a millimeter less than three centimeters apart. So as you can see from what we've shown, this apparatus will show that when current goes in opposite directions, on two current carrying wires, they will separate. They will have a force of re a repulsion that they, that they will repel each other.